Welcome back to our YouTube channel, fellow art enthusiasts and history buffs. If you're new here, don't forget to hit that like button, share this video with your friends, and subscribe for more fascinating content. Today, we're embarking on a thrilling journey through time, exploring the rich history and stunning artistry of the Byzantine and Christian Museum in Athens, Greece. From late antiquity to the 20th century, we'll be unraveling the evolution of Byzantine and Christian art, so buckle up and let's dive into our past. Ever wondered about the evolution of Byzantine and Christian art from late antiquity to the 20th century? Today, we introduce the Byzantine and Christian Museum in Athens, Greece, an epicenter of Byzantine and post-Byzantine art. Established in the Roaring Twenties and managed by the Greek Ministry of Culture, this museum serves as a time capsule of the Greco-Byzantine cultural influence. Prepare for a journey through time as we explore the museum's vast collection of over 25,000 artifacts. Our journey begins in the Byzantine era stretching from the 4th century to 1453. This was an epic of remarkable cultural and artistic evolution, and it's all captured within the dedicated wing of the Byzantine and Christian Museum. Here you'll find an impressive array of artifacts that showcase the Greco-Byzantine cultural influence. From meticulously sculpted figures that tell tales of a bygone age, to vibrant icons that were once the centerpieces of worship, every piece has a story to tell. There are paintings too, their colors and details still vibrant, offering a glimpse into the aesthetic sensibilities of the era. And let's not forget the mosaics, their intricate designs a testament to the craftsmanship of the time. Each artifact, whether it's a sculpture, an icon, a painting, or a mosaic, serves as a tangible link to the past, allowing us to connect with the people and cultures of the Byzantine era. As we explore, we get a sense of the profound influence this period had on the course of history, not just in Greece, but across the world. As we transition from the Byzantine era, we step into a time of significant cultural shift. Entering the post-Byzantine period, we witness the interplay between Eastern and Western artistic traditions. This era, spanning from 1453 to the 20th century, is a fascinating fusion of influences and styles. As we navigate through the second wing of the museum, we are introduced to an array of artifacts that artistically narrate this period of history. Here we see the transition from the Byzantine Empire with its distinct Eastern aesthetic to the influences from the West that began to permeate the art of the time. This convergence of styles is evident across a variety of mediums, from sculptures and paintings to ceramics and textiles. Imagine the hands that crafted these pieces, the minds that conceived their design, and the societies that treasured them. Every artifact here tells a story, not only of individual artistry, but also of cultural exchange and evolution. In addition to these historical pieces, the museum also showcases a rotating exhibition of 20th century Greek artists who were influenced by Byzantine art. This collection serves as a testament to the enduring legacy of the Byzantine aesthetic, its influences seeping into the fabric of modern Greek art and beyond. By exploring the Byzantine and Christian Museum, we've journeyed through centuries of art history witnessing the evolution and influence of Byzantine and Christian art. As we leave the post-Byzantine era, we find ourselves standing at the crossroads of history, where the past meets the present. Byzantine and Christian art has left an indelible mark on the world, influencing countless generations of artists and shaping the course of art history. Beyond the museum walls, we see the echoes of this rich artistic tradition in contemporary art and architecture. From the intricate mosaics of modern churches to the ethereal beauty of contemporary iconography, the legacy of Byzantine and Christian art continues to inspire and enchant. Not only is this legacy evident in the physical art we see today, but also in the methods, techniques, and philosophies that underpin modern artistic practice. The Byzantine Empire may have fallen, but its artistic spirit lives on. So as we close this chapter of our journey, let's reflect on the timeless beauty of Byzantine and Christian art and its enduring influence on the world we know today. As we see, art is not just about beauty, it's about history, culture, and the human condition. And that's the true beauty of art. Scene six, YouTube Outro. We hope you enjoyed this journey through the Byzantine and Christian Museum. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more amazing content. 
Leave a comment below about your favorite part of the video. See you in the next video.